So another interesting feature of the business suite that is definitely buried <laughs> is tags and notifications. So, and also I don't quite understand why this isn't part of the inbox because if you think about like the inbox is managing everything that people have responded to, but yet the, the at tags are not in the inbox. So that seems a little wacky, but if you go here to um, post and stories, and click on it and you get here and you'll see this thing that says mention and tags at the bottom. So it's all the mentions and tags that you've been in. Now a couple of things is it would be nice if it had you know some filters and stuff like that but it's new so maybe maybe as it you know develops as they develop it in the future it'll, it'll be more dynamic but um but what's great about it is like I find at least on Facebook that sometimes we mention we miss mentions and so that's a bummer. Like someone took the time to call our business out or call your small business out and you know, you don't even acknowledge it. I always um, equate it to like, you know, you're walking down the street and someone says hi or tells you how great you are and then you don't even say hi back. You just walk right past them. So I think it's really important to, to acknowledge the customers when they post about you or at tag you or whatever. No, when you have a really pop popular brand, it is, hard to do that, but if you do, um, like one of the brands we work with, that's something that they do and it really creates this um, this army of customers that are brand advocates for you. So I do think it pays off if you take the time to do it. But anyways, so that's my spiel. But, so this is pretty cool, like, so for example, this was a project we worked, or that was a client we worked on, worked with, um, and so they mentioned us in their release of their this short film they made, which was so funny, actually, um, the wage on the wage app. Um, I think it was called Living Wage. So, anyways, if I go in here and um, I can do a couple things, so it got, I can have com, I can comment back and say like, I, we actually just liked liked it, but we could comment back and just be like, oh, it was great to be a part of it or whatever. And um, we could actually share it from here, like it like we did, um, and. You can actually view it on Facebook from here, which I thought was kind of nice. So if you just wanted to have a little better look. And you can also copy the link. And I was thinking that this is really good for like if you need to share it with a team member. Because then they can go. Because sometimes like, especially with clients, is you'll have, um, you know, you won't exactly, maybe if you have someone that's written something negative or if you want to share with the team like something good that was written you know it'd be nice to be able to send a link around for people to easily view the post and where it's at and talk about how to respond so I think that's really cool enough now Instagram is a little different so this is an Instagram post and um, this is a client of ours and okay so she mentioned us um, so there's no way directly here to respond, which would be so nice, but you don't have it. But if you click on the three dots, and here's a pro tip, <laughs> anything, always look for these three dots on Facebook. There's usually more that you can do on Facebook and Instagram. There's usually some editing features or whatever. Just always look at it and play around and see, see what's up there. So anyway, so if you click on the three dots, you can get view on Instagram. And if you're logged into your account, then you can like and comment or do whatever you like and, and respond to the comment. Now you can also, from here, just copy the link. So say it's again one of those things that you wanna get, you know, send it to the team so they can see it or send it to a client or get feedback on how to respond, um, then you can do that. Now I think this is pretty cool feature here is you can share to your stories. So I can, with one click, share this to my Instagram stories, which I think is great. And you can add, you know, change the color of the background, or you can add, not background, but you can add text. I could make a, a sticker if I wanted. Um, I mean, some of it's not as awesome as like, you know, the stickers they have on Instagram, but it's still pretty cool. Um, so anyways, so it looks like you know, and you can only share it to the Instagram stories, but how nice not to have to be on your phone to um, share it. So I think that's like super fun. Um, now I'm, I'm hoping we see in the future like the ability to, you know, like if you respond to it, maybe click off and like if maybe there'll be some some um, filtering features like, you know, time and stuff like that. 
So anyways, um, hope this is helpful, but um, I think it's a pretty cool feature. All right, thank you. Have a great day.